In this lesson, we will discuss a special type of functions called surjective functions or onto functions. A function f from a to b is called surjective or onto function if the range of function is equal to b, the second set, which means that every element of set b must be an image of at least one element of set A. So let's take a look on this example here. We are given two sets A and B and F is a rule which transforms elements of set A into elements of set B. Let's call this rule F. Obviously this rule fulfills conditions for this relation to be called a function because its domain must be equal to set A and none of the element in domain must be repeated. Obviously those conditions are fulfilled here. So this f is a function. This rule of transformation is a function, no doubt about that. Now we want to see is this function an onto function or surjective function. For that purpose we will calculate the range of this function. From this arrow diagram, we will find what is the range of function. So let's find range of function. Range of function is collection of those elements of B, which are image of some element of A. Or in other words, wherever there is an arrow that is pointing toward that element. So the first element in the range is A and then B appears twice because B is an image of 1 as well as B is an image of 5. That's why it is appearing twice. C is not an image of any element of A so it will not appear in the range. F will appear twice because F is image of 3 as well as it is image of 7. So F appears twice and H appears twice for the same reason. So this is the range. But this is not equal to B. This is not equal to set B because, because B, set B has two elements because and P because B and P are two elements belonging to set B which are not in the range, which are not in the range. That's why this function is not surjective function. Another representation of the same set could be a tabular form. If we were to take a look on the same set in tabular form, this wouldn't be any different, but in tabular form, let's do that. In tabular form, form what would be the function? The function f would be equal to 1b, 1b and then 2a. 2a and then 3f, 3f and 4h and then 5b, 5b and 6h, 6h and then 7f. In this form, this is the same function, we have just changed its representation. Again, what is the range? Range is, in tabular form, range is equal to sec collection of second element of every pair. So if we calculate range again, the range of function, range of f would be equal to the collection of second element of every pair in the 
tabular form of function that would be b a f h b h and f this is the same range which we calculated using arrow diagram but we can see this is again not equal to b so f is not on to function so f is not surjective function surjective function and now let's take a look on another example here for this given graph a function f a function f from r to r r is a set of real numbers a function f from r to r defined by defined by y equal to x square plus 1 is not surjective is not surjective explain explain why is it not surjective function the reason is the reason is that in the definition of function so let's take in the definition for all x for all x belonging to r means for any real number x square is always x square is always greater than r equal to 0 the value of x whatever the value of x is x square is always greater than or equal to 0 that is a property of real numbers if we add 1 to this this will be this will tell us that x square plus 1 if we add 1 on both sides that will be greater than or equal to 0 plus 1 it means that y should be greater than or equal to 1 for every value of x for every x belonging to r no matter whatever is the value of x the range should always be greater than or equal to 1 but set b is since range of function range of function f is a subset is not equal to r because r contains r contains numbers which are less than 1 which are which are less than less than 1 if you draw a real line then on the real line if this is 0 and this is 1 there is a half of the real number system is to the left of 1 but range of function range of function is only in this range that is it this range ends up here but the system of real numbers is r that is a whole bigger than range of functions so this is a real number and it maps elements in all this line but range of function is limited only up to this point that's why this function is not on to function so f is not not surjective surjective and if you are ever required to find at least one function which is a surjective function so here if we write an example give at least give at least one example one example 
example of a function function which is which is surjective any linear function would be a surjective so our answer would be solution to this question would be simply f defined from r to r any linear function such that such that f of x is equal to 2x minus r plus 3 is is surjective is surjective the reason if x is negative negative numbers will produce negative numbers for the range positive number of the domain will produce positive number for the range and obviously there will be a number which will produce zero so all the positive and negative numbers including zero in the domain are going to produce positive and negative as well as zero in the range therefore every function without any restriction on the uh, on the variable on the input variable linear functions are subjective functions